The human history of Virginia's Appalachian Plateau has been married to the presence of a single natural resource, coal. Coal mining has shaped the culture and economy of this region of Virginia for the last 200 years. Coal mining operations, like you see above, pepper the landscape of the Appalachian Plateau. Coal is formed from ancient plant material that was buried under sediments. This makes it an example of an organic sedimentary rock. Around 323 to 360 million years ago, during the Mississippian Age, vast swaths of ferns and other plants provided the carbon that makes coal such a powerful fuel. After these plants were buried, the overlying sediments put pressure on them, and the heat from the Earth's interior drove the water from the material. Given enough time, heat, and pressure, the layer formed a hard, dense sheet that was later exposed when uplift brought it back up to the surface. Coal is found layered in sedimentary rocks. As the ancient environment changed, different kinds of sediments accumulated and formed the layers that are exposed today. Shale indicates deposition of mud, limestone, shallow marine environments, sandstone, sand, as if on a beach or riverbank. Here we see a layer of coal sandwiched between sandstone above and shale and limestone below. Even though most coal in Virginia is found in the Appalachian Plateau, smaller deposits exist in the Piedmont region's Triassic basins, like we see here in Midlothian near Richmond. Coal is a heavy industry and thousands of workers mine it and move it to its final destination. Trains transport this fuel across the state to ports in eastern Virginia where to ship to power plants in the United States and beyond. This very short tunnel through the Bee Rock Formation is just one of hundreds built to help move coal across the state.